can be found up and down the west coast of North America. They can range in size from a couple of hundred to nearly 1,000 pounds. Now, we will be seeing a lot more of Seymour later on in the day. Uh, for right now, though, I'm supposed to be joined by this new intern. Now, Wait, I'm here! I'm coming! You. I am Dr. Zalofis. Nice to meet you, Dr. Zalamimus. <laughs> it's Zalofis. That's what I said. <laughs> okay, we will work on that a little later on. Uh, but for right now, this is the plan for their tour. It is the only copy that I have, so what I'm thinking is I'm going to put you in charge of it. Don't let anything happen to it. Okay, see Preston, son. You got this. You can count on me, I won't let you down. Love that. I'm actually gonna go check on the preserve. So Neutron, Neutron, since you are new, just don't touch anything. <laughs> yeah, you got it, Dr. Zucchini. <laughs> Guys, I cannot believe she's putting me in charge of this plan on my first day. I am so excited. It looks like we're gonna do some pretty cool things today. I bet you guys are wondering what we're doing, right? Yeah? Okay, first thing on the list, meeting the doctor, which we already did. And then it looks like the next thing we're gonna do is do some pretty cool animals. What and was that them. noise? I told you not to touch anything. Well, I was just done it by my own business. Who makes this your business and turn it off? Hurry. Okay, um, I'll put this right here. How about this? No, oh, try something over there. Uh, this one? How about lower? How about this one? That is not what I meant. But that was a close one. I wasn't sure you were doing all those things. Anyway, two. Zootopia. It's a lofus. That's what I said. Okay. 
Here at the center, we have been studying the food sources and the eating behaviors of the animals here in our care. This allows us to understand and help sustain wild populations. For this next part, I will be help from a young volunteer. You had your hand right up. Come on down. Hello. What's your name? Harper, where are you from? All the way from America. Clyde, right? Of course you do. That's why you volunteered. I'm going to have you stand right here because he's going to come out any minute now. And this is packed with all the nutrients that he needs. Have you ever fed a sea lion before? No? This will be your first time. So this is going to be a cake when we're going to get him. And you said you're from America. What part of America are you from? Around here. So you're from Florida. Good to know. So you probably have a fed a sea lion. So this is Clyde. And you're going to take it just like this. And you're going to do a big toss for me. Excellent job. Let's go one more because you are catching on pretty fast. Excellent job, Harper. All right, come over here. We're going to get a picture because you were amazing. And he's going to come up here. And he's going to pose for us. And you're going to come right here. Put your hand on that flipper. Take a look at everyone. And on, oh, that's a big yawn. On the uh, count of three, we are going to yell sardines real loud. One, two, three, sardines! Excellent job, you guys. Give it up for my youngest trainer. She was amazing. Um, doctor, <laughs> doctor zero personality. <laughs> I was looking for Clyde. I bet that's Clyde, right? <laughs> Yes, neutron, very observant. And it's Dr. Zalophis. That's what I said. Ugh, never mind. We have already started the day and we have yet to start testing your pinniped knowledge. So question number one, how tall would you say sea lions are? Well, looking at him, I'd say three, maybe four feet tops. Check again. Check again. Whoa, he's huge. Well, yes, sea lions can actually grow up to nine feet in length. Oh, My wow. favorite fun fact is they actually have three tiny toenails and those rear flippers to get those hard to reach spots. Clyde, you have toenails, do you think I can see them? Okay. Oh, I can see them. Oh, I can smell that in too, bud. Well, Clyde is showing he was a very social animal. We found they have their own personalities, likes, and dislikes. He really seems to like hanging out with me. Oh, you guys are adorable. He's also been very motivated in interacting with us and participating in his own health care. <laughs> if you don't mind, I'm going to take him to go find Seymour. Why don't you help yourself to a complimentary refreshment? Wow, thanks, Dr. Xerox. Copy that. <laughs> I am pretty thirsty, so drink sounds amazing right now. In these um, Neutron, your break's over. Uh oh, the can. Pectoral muscles to help him jump high 